and um, yeah, just stay tuned, y'all. I want to know you deeper. I want to know you like how lungs long to be acquainted with breath. Nothing less than a desperate att attempt at holding in life as if afraid to exhale like air is on short supply. I need you. And I'm convinced it's the only way I will survive. So, it doesn't take rocket science to know creation is only at its best when in your hands, so I come to you. As just a need of second wind from the potter, a base that needs to be refilled with living water. Cause some days I show up to church on Sunday singing hollow hollow use blues, but I know I should be full of praise. I know it's cause I'm showing face. For the sake of showing face, like I can show up and be fake in your face when you know what goes on underneath the spring of my good day. I guess these genes in my DNA passed down from the days of Abel and Cain have me acting like your father, Adam. Hiding. In a bush, with leaves to show my shame. I guess you can say covering up has been my go-to since tasting the fruit that condemns me. If you look closely, you can see the patches I place on myself to fix the seams of my confidence. Sewn onto this old wine skin, beating, leaking rivers of hot mess everywhere through the fabric of my strength. Like a dam, one crack away from breaking, I can't hold back these burdens anymore. So I will let them flow at your feet. And trust you won't let me drown. Truth is, lately I've been wearing more Christian attire to avoid undressing deep rooted issues inside entirely. Too nervous to unpack this politically correct disguise because it will show that I am fragile. Yeah. A glass casket that contains the remains of a broken conscience, still trying to find rest and peace and bounce back from Eden. So I implored that you know the war raging behind this cage of bones and still choose me. Mm -hmm. Despite a heart. Far from angel, more like beast, fall up in grace. You don't treat me like an animal. You don't throw my past in my face when it's hard for me to forget my trail of darkness. Bearing a light with no shine, food of idols, an appetite for flesh. This body, a haven of sin, kin to rebellion. If the reason innocent lamb would have himself stretched out on wood to bear a world's worth of burdens on behalf of man's brokenness, a banner of love is this that you will wear the shape of humanity on your shoulders and endure hardship unto death just to call this lost boy home. The least I can do is lift my hands and trumpet my voice to play the sound of your reign. So I will gladly become Jericho and let these walls crumble if it means every stronghold will become ash and I can march further into your presence before you as a man surrendering his need to protect himself and learning his habit to duck and cover out of fear for rejection because I am persuaded that neither death, nor life, nor power, nor principality, angel, or created thing could ever separate me from the love of God. I am ready to send a stage his faith and display the dust of his chains so the audience can spot the light where I stand and they will see this is the result of something that could not be arranged by man nor earned by my best audition on my best day. I am only qualified for this part because you have chosen to love me. And in a broad way, your mercy has stolen the show. It reminds me how the red letters in the text and lines on your back read the script of my redemption. Title it is finished, curtains closed on what I used to be. So Jesus. Your name is all the credit. And I need you to direct me. No smoke. No mirrors. This is a real act of worship from the upper room of my soul. And it will seek you daily. Even when my mind wants to betray me with business from my past failures. I know I don't have to answer just because they are knocking. I will remember the gift of your presence inside that is able to sympathize with my weakness and give me power to overcome those thoughts that try to break in and enter. The enemy may have robbed me before, but he can no longer steal my joy because this house has been arrested by you who is greater, which means everything else has to bow and surrender, just as I would do the same. Thank you all. Love you.